of the things that I've been grateful for as a Hawk has definitely been being back on campus, considering everything going on. It's been great seeing professors, whether it's online or in person, and being able to be in this environment. One thing that I've been really grateful for as a Hawk has been the Rockhurst community. I've really been able to see the Rockhurst community connect in a safe way, whether that's playing intramurals and in sports outside, picnicking, going on walks, and I'm also really thankful for the faculty and staff because I think they've really represented Cura Personalis this year, which is care for the whole person by just encouraging us and supporting us through this transition in this difficult time. We always talk about Rockhurst being a close and tight-knit community, and I feel like the people here on our campus definitely have done that. Even though we can't be together in large groups and have all the traditions that we have, I've had so many people reach out to me via text or online and doing something virtually or making events virtual so we can still have those traditions as best as we can given the circumstances. One of the things I've been grateful for is just the ability of Rockhurst of faculty and staff to find a way for the physical therapy program to get back on campus to do our labs. The lab portion of our curriculum is a really vital component of our learning. So for the staff and faculty to be able to find a way to make that work for us that was safe and effective, uh, we are all, I speak on behalf of all of my uh, peers that we are very thankful for that. I think one of the greatest challenges has just been getting to meet the new students. I know that like for student senate example, uh, we had a record number of applicants this year, um, and so it's awesome to be able to meet students that way. But other than that, I really haven't been given the opportunity to meet students um, like we have in the past with move-in day or uh, orientation or any of the other awesome activities that student life and the rest of campus puts on. Another thing that has been very challenging here on campus is really be able to find things to do, um, especially during this time we're encouraged not to travel too much and so just being on campus and finding those different things to be able to hang out with your friends, socially distance has been very challenging. Not being in the classroom, it's different. Like I said, like being online has been great because everyone's been so engaged, but just like the connection you have with your peers in the classroom is different than online so that's one thing I do miss but um, I'm hopeful that we'll get back there. One of my greatest challenges would have to be I guess like staying motivated because it's been kind of hard like especially with everything going on and it's like a lot of different impacts like the visitation and classes being online really had an impact on how well I did in school I feel like a little bit. I feel like the motivation has kind of went away. My biggest hope is that we're back on campus in the spring. I know a lot of things can happen over the span of a winter period, but that's my biggest hope for sure. Just to spend my last semester here at Rockers soaking up every last moment. Something I've seen this past semester is just a lot of growth in community as a Rockers community and family. And so I think my biggest hope would just be that we continue to rely on each other in that way and that we can continue to grow as a community. One hope that I have for Rockers this next semester is that, you know, as a senior, we're able to celebrate in person, regardless of um, if it has to be a smaller graduation. But I would love to be able to celebrate with my classmates in person. I hope we get to be together. <laughs> um, and I hope that all of the new students, like transfers and freshmen this year, have been able to kind of buy into the Rockhurst experience and that this spring, like all the hard work of us this fall pays off and we get to be together and we get to see, even if it's COVID style, get to see each other and get to see the Rockhurst community coming together. And that everyone who hasn't had the chance to experience it the way I have pre-COVID, uh, kind of gets to have those experiences before this year is up. Just using this time to grow as people and I'm really hoping that for a future generation that they can think about this time and see it in a positive light.